From massive ancient artwork only visible from the sky to the enigmatic properties of a mysterious sphere, today we look at the seven biggest signs aliens have visited Earth. Number 7. Nazca Lines If you are flying over the desert southeast of Lima, Peru, you will be able to see long lines and patterns that look as if the Earth was tattooed. There are over 70 of these figures, including spiders, monkeys, various plants, and human-like creatures that have been etched into the ground. Because of their size and the ability to really only see their full outlines from the sky, one might think that these were modern-day art projects created with airline passengers in mind. The problem is, these geoglyphs, as they are technically known, are thought to have been made over 2,000 years ago, long before even da Vinci had fantasies of flying machines. These are the Nazca Lines, and they were created by scooping off the top layer of this South American desert's red dirt and rocks on the desert surface to reveal the white sand below. Scientists believe they were designed by the natives in order to communicate with the gods or mark points of ceremonial significance. And they back this up by saying the shapes can also be seen by climbing the surrounding hills. However, only parts of the shapes can be seen and you can only get the full effect of all the patterns by traveling in the air. Many people believe this is proof that the lines were created by extraterrestrials who visited our planet in the past. The markings could possibly be a way for aliens to mark locations of importance or send a message about the area to future space travelers. Another fact that backs up this theory is that curves and lines that make up the shapes are almost geometrically perfect. This type of precision and complexity wouldn't have been likely from Peru's native inhabitants during the time period they are thought to have been created. Number 6. Ancient Aluminum The metal aluminum we know of today was first synthesized in a lab in 1825 as a tiny hunk of tin, and even after that, the process took almost another 50 years before it could be manufactured in bulk at a cost-effective manner. At the turn of the 20th century, this new metal started to become commonplace and was hailed as one of the materials of the future. Flash forward to 1973. Workers alongside a river near the Transylvania village of Ayud in Romania discover a strange object a little over 30 feet underground. At first it was thought to be part of a modern day tool that had rusted, but after it was taken to a nearby laboratory and tested, it turned out to be much more. After analyzing and dating the object, instead of understanding it as usually the case with such tests, the archaeologists found that the object was even more mysterious than they had even imagined. It turned out the object was made out of aluminum, but it wasn't some discarded piece of modern-day machinery, as the dating methods that were used calculated it to be 250,000 years old. Scientists have been studying the object and scratching their heads for the last 45 years. But the more tests that are run, and the more they seem to find out about it, the more confounding the ancient puzzle becomes. They discovered that the object is not completely aluminum, but more a complicated mixture of 90% aluminum and 11 other types of metals. Because of this combination of metals, the object is unlikely to have naturally formed and its design only gives credence to the idea that it was manufactured, as it has features like holes that make it appear as though it was part of a larger mechanism. As the date places the object at a time period in which Homo sapiens had only first evolved and were completely incapable of creating such an object, many scientists believe that it is of an extraterrestrial nature. More specifically, part of an alien spacecraft. Number 5. Soxahuaman For almost 1,000 years, a stone fortress just outside the Peruvian city of Cusca has withstood the ground-rattling earthquakes the region is known for. The architecture of this structure has perplexed scientists for decades, as the techniques needed to construct it didn't exist until recently, and still would be difficult to replicate. The site is known as Soxahuaman, 
or Royal Eagle, and its walls are made up of giant stones that fit together so tightly that not even a playing card can be slipped between them. Though many believe the fortress may have been built as recently as 500 years ago, even the Incas that ruled Cusca during that time period, expert stoneworkers as they may have been, would have been drastically overachieving in this effort, given the technologies attributed to them. Some scientists believe that the only way that these heavy stones could have been carved and put into place so perfectly is using methods like laser cutting and other modern machinery. This is why one of the prevailing theories about Royal Eagle's construction is that it was achieved by otherworldly means. Number 4. Begong Pipes Deep in the mountains of China, there is what seems to be either an ancient temple, industrial works project, or miracle of nature. The Begong Pipes of Qinghai Providence have been one of the world's most thought-provoking mysteries of science. The forest around Mount Begong is considered to be historically uninhabited by man, other than by nomadic tribes, without the wherewithal to build complex irrigation structures. Yet if you enter Mount Begong through one of the three tunnels that lead within, you will find dozens of pipes organized in an apparently intentional pattern. These pipes have been found to lead miles through the mountain and end at a cove that holds a small saltwater lake. When studied by the Beijing Institute of Geology, they were found to be made predominantly of iron, along with some trace samples of other unknown minerals, and to be over 150,000 years old. A subsequent study by the China Earthquake Administration found that some of the pipes were putting off abnormally high levels of radiation. What makes Mount Begong even more peculiar is that the shore encircling the lake is littered with odd-shaped rocks that are unnaturally arranged, with some jutting upwards, as if they are the last remains of a building. There are also structures and markings outside of the cave's entrance that are almost too triangular to be something not purposely constructed. This is why researchers have considered that it could be alien-made. Number 3. The Pyramids The Pyramids of Giza have long been shrouded with conspiracies of alien meddling. But when you look at some of the recurring patterns and questions arisen by their nearly unfathomable creation, it's hard to ignore the possibility of outside forces, setting aside the fact that the sheer amount of manpower and resources it would take to physically build the pyramids. Let's look at the possible intentions in their design. The three pyramids were built almost 5,000 years ago, yet they were built in such a way to be exactly aligned with the constellation Orion. Yes, the Egyptians were known for being dedicated astronomers, but doing so to the degree that the pyramids are aligned is difficult even today. The pyramids of Giza stand out in another way that suggests alien interference compared to the other pyramids and tombs of Egypt. They are in pristine condition. This goes hand in hand with the fact that the pyramids of Giza are so vastly superior in architectural innovation that even the most advanced civilization at the time couldn't have achieved their construction alone. Number 2. Val Johnson It's easy to see things when you're driving alone through the cold Minnesota night. But Sheriff Val Johnson knew the roads around his town, and he definitely knows what he saw the night of August 26, 1979. While he was on duty monitoring the outskirts of town, he saw a bright light up ahead of him, closing in fast. Flying just above the road at an incredible speed, the light hit his car and enveloped him with what he recalls feeling like being a cushioned yet jarring jolt. When he came to, he realized he had driven off the road and gotten stuck in a gully. Now this might sound like a fabrication of an intoxicated person up until this point, but what happens next is something out of the twilight zone. Sheriff Johnson decides to call the station and report the incident, but when he looks at the time, he is stunned to find that 14 minutes had passed. He then looked his car over and saw that it had severe damage to the front as if he had hit something head on. But when fellow officers arrived, they could find no evidence of another vehicle or injured animal. Upon receiving medical treatment, the sheriff was noted for what appeared to be severe ultraviolet radiation exposure, which left the area around his nose and eyes badly burned. Now you can draw any conclusion you want for this, but if you ask Sheriff Johnson, 
what it was, he will tell you it was not of this world. Number 1. Bet's Sphere In Jacksonville, Florida in 1974, after a forest fire had ravaged the woods behind his house, Terry Betts decided to take a walk and survey the damage. What he found would change his life forever. He saw something shining among the ashes, a sphere about 20 centimeters around that bared a triangular marking and appeared untarnished by the fire. He took it home and showed it to his friends and family members who didn't know what it was. Their best guess was that it was either part of a damaged satellite, a military experiment, or a strange art project. But one day, when Terry was playing music, the sphere started to vibrate on its own. He thought that maybe he should take it to the government to be tested, but he was hesitant as he did not want to be exploited. However, after several more bizarre incidents with the sphere, like the family dog acting irrationally anxious, the bawling seeming to roll on its own, he decided he had to know exactly what it was. The sphere was taken by the US Navy, and the more tests it was put under, the more questions that came forward. They discovered that the outer layer of the ball was made out of an incredibly magnetic form of stainless steel which produced four separate magnetic poles. Through X-ray, the researchers were able to determine that there were two more spheres inside. They believed that these two spheres were made out of elements that no one had yet discovered, and that they possibly have some atomic numbers higher than uranium, and if the sphere was attempted to be forcefully opened, it might cause an atomic explosion. The source and purpose of this sphere to this day cannot be explained by modern science. 